For years, SHIP has been a training ground for seeing eye dogs. Education professor Dr. Andrea Malmont commonly spends a full academic year with her training puppy in tow. Her dedication led a young boy to raise one of his own. Marina Burnett has the story. Meet Bert. He's a four-month-old yellow lab training for seeing eye dog service. His owner, 11-year-old Joe Surachek. He was inspired when his mom brought him to campus to visit Dr. Malmont's seeing eye dog. I saw a potential of giving him an opportunity to come and invite him to the puppy club meeting and I let him be the handler of him and I saw that he took off really fast. And the responsibility is all his. You have to feed him, play with him, take him outside. You know, the child gets to, you know, be the one that's going to be responsible. So when we do have puppy club meetings, you know, they're the ones that are doing the training circle. When they have outings, you know, he's the one that should be handling the dog. Joe's mom didn't think Joe would want to commit to seeing the training through. I was surprised. I wasn't sure that he would like the idea of having to raise and love this puppy and then say goodbye. Bert will be with the Sororacheks for about another year, and then he goes back to New Jersey for more training. He was okay with that, and he knows that he's the you know when Bert leaves us, he's gonna go help somebody else. When Bert leaves, Joe will see him perform at a town walk where he'll demonstrate the skills he's learned with his new trainer. But you can't get close to them. You can't go up and approach them, pet them, talk to them. After that, evaluators decide whether Bert is suitable to be a service dog. That is the last piece. When you get that letter and that picture, you know that they're, they're off and doing great things. The Surachek's plan to follow in Dr. Malmont's footsteps oh, once Bert leaves them. For? As long as my son wants to do it, we will do it. And another puppy will take Bert's place, giving Joe another Bert 16 shake. months of puppy love and hard work. Marina Barnett, SUTV News. Once the puppies go back to New Jersey, they undergo a health check and are sent on for more training with their perfect match or become dogs for breeding. The Seeing Eye Dog Foundation in Morristown, New Jersey raises six to seven hundred dogs each year.